So I took another trip to a state park near my home. New trail, never been on it before. Nice little hike. Actually, it was a very long hike and a steep one at that. But regardless, this week's challenge was to find a perceived no, no, line. No, no, and I think no. I accomplished it with the, the rafters being burnt out of an old ruins. It kind of makes a, a pattern of a line going across the wall. I kind of like that. But we're going to edit a different photo today. So let's get started. Hey, I'm excited about photography and I hope you are too. So let's learn together. This photo kind of intrigues me a bit because uh, it's a nice photo and all. I, I like it. I like it. I don't know. Maybe some other people don't like it. But this is a photo I'm going to edit today because I want to show you a little something. I think it's going to turn out okay. The sky has zero color. I mean, it's actually, it's obviously overexposed. I'm give it the auto treatment. Okay. And we're going to do the uh, 69. I like this little bit of fuzz down here, so I want to make sure I get from end to end fuzz. I don't really care too much about the sky at the moment. So end to end fuzz, yeah, it's pretty much straight. Maybe. Okay, that's good. So now that we have that done, I'm going to go ahead and move the clarity in here. But then the dehazing. Oh, look at the blue skies in there. There is a touch of blue sky there. And last but not least, I'm going to try something by pulling this out and over. Full negative 100, which is basically taking. All of the whites, as you have this this histogram is black to white, and in between each of these you have straight up black, and shadows goes to the exposure, and highlights, and whites. If I pull all the whites into the highlight section. I don't know. I think it looks good. If we check to see what we have with the J key. Let's see, we got some darks here, but they're not too bad. They're kind of where they should be. If you're trying to maybe pull those out the other way. It's not too bad. Go full screen with it. I like it. I like it a lot. That dehazing kind of brings out the sky a little bit. And uh, adjusting the histogram a little off the white, a little off the black. There you go. Hope this helps you. Let me know in the comments below. Okay, that's it for this video, and thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, smash that like button. I post a weekly video, so be sure not to miss next week's video by hitting that subscribe button and that notification bell. Feel free to leave a comment below, and we'll see you next week.